everyone, welcome back, and thank you for joining us on the Live Unreal with Glover U podcast, where every week, Jeff Glover will dive deep into the questions that you are asking. He understands the challenges you are facing on a day-to-day basis because he still works every day on the front lines of real estate, with him and his team closing over 1,000 homes per year. On this episode, we will go over step eight in the Glover U Cell system, building and working your database. In this step, Jeff will teach you how to maximize the best ROI for your business. Now, let's hear from Jeff Glover on step eight in the 20 steps of the Glover U Cell system. Building and working your database. I'm working with you today. It's, we're having a discussion around what are you doing to add value to your database in 2019? Okay, what am I doing currently to add value? And next, what could I do to add value this year? What did I do last year? What could I do in 2019? And as you heard, it doesn't have to cost money. Now, is it gonna take time? Sure. Are we gonna see results from it overnight? Absolutely not. But it is the best ROI, there's no question. I wrote down, don't think in 2019, a CRM will solve all your problems. I can't tell you how often I hear Oh, but the CRM, oh, but the CRM, oh, but the CRM, this is cool, you gotta try it out. 18 months ago, maybe 20 months ago now, at 1,000 transactions or 900 transactions, we didn't have a CRM. Our CRM was an Excel spreadsheet, and our leads and appointments were on paper that we would hand out. You know, leads would come in and we'd text them out. We'd email stuff out. Past client database, it's on Excel spreadsheet. We didn't have drip campaigns. We didn't have reminders. We had paper leads. So I'm not standing up here poo-pooing the idea of having a great CRM, because don't get me wrong, especially for the 40 or 50% of you that are with KW, I know they're rolling out a pretty sweet CRM. And when it comes out, we're gonna use it. We currently use Sync, by the way, C-I-N-C. That is probably the, the, the best in, in the market that I've seen. We did a lot of research on that. But the moral of the story is it's not about what the CRM is going to do for us or our business. It's about what we're going to do to fill it. That's the question you need to be looking at. What am I going to do in 2019 to fill my CRM? What am I going to do in 2019 and beyond to get people into the CRM? That's the question, not what CRM are you using, what drip campaign. No, what am I gonna do to get them in? Next I wrote down, it's important, and this is a big one in our system, it's, in, it's, it's important that you understand the difference between effectively working your database and just setting people up on a drip campaign. Understand the difference between effectively working your database and just setting people up on a drip campaign. We hear from our coaching clients all the time. Well, yeah, I got a a cool CRM. You know, I'm using this, I'm using that. Okay, how do you work your database? Well, everyone's set up on drip campaigns. All right, Um, anything else? Well, no, that's the the beauty of the CRM. (laughs) I can just set them up on drip campaigns and forget it. Okay, Uh, how how many deals are you getting out of that? Well, I'm not getting any yet, but I believe this thing is, is cool. It's gonna turn into something. It's gonna work. We hear that constantly. That's not working a database, all right? That is basically putting leads in the trash. And quite honestly, it's okay to have this somewhat of a trash can mentality. I had it for years and years. I had no choice. I didn't have a CRM. <laughs> so when I followed up with the lead and it didn't turn into anything, it just went in the garbage. I didn't have anything to set it up on or drip campaigns or drop on this and send them that. So what does working your database actually look like? You heard some formulas here. I just shared with you ours, four, two, one. All right, we're beefing that up. It's like five, four, three, two, one now or something. I don't know. Something has to improve in that realm. Thank you for taking your time to join Jeff today on the Live Unreal with Glover U podcast to take the real estate self-assessment that begins the Glover U sales system and have a member of Glover U get on a call with you to create an action plan to improve your score. Go to www.gloveru.com self. If you enjoyed this episode, 
please subscribe. Search for Live Unreal with Glover You on iTunes or Podbean and subscribe today. Until next time, remember, working your database is going to take time. You are not going to see results right away, but it is the best ROI.